click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, uh, this is plan number 24 again based on media mix. We have multiple medias here and it, it is more or less similar to the earlier one. Let's see the problem first and then we'll proceed further. Agashi and company plans to reach target audience belonging to two different monthly income groups. The first with income greater than 15,000 and the second with income less than 15,000. The total advertising budget is rupees 2 lakhs. Advertising on TV cost rupees 50,000 for one program. Whereas advertising on radio costs rupees 20,000 for one program. For contract reasons, at least three programs must be given on TV and number of radio programs are limited to five only. One TV program covers 4,50,000 audience belonging to income group having more than 15,000 monthly income. So higher income group. Whereas it reaches to 50,000 audience belonging to below rupees 15,000 monthly income group. Similarly, one radio program reaches 20,000 and 80,000 audiences belonging to above 15,000 and below 15,000 monthly income groups respectively. Formulate the linear programming problem. So here we are again need to work out the same thing we will make two columns one for TV and one for radio so here is my columns in my first column I will note down the first media that is TV and in the second we will note down the second media that is radio and here is my supply or the availability so what is the cost the cost involved is 50,000 and radio is 20,000 so here I will write for TV it is 50,000 and for radio it is 20,000 and my total budget is rupees 2 lakhs then they are given for contract reasons at least 3 programs on TV and radio programs are limited to 5 so minimum three programs on TV and maximum five on radio. One TV program covers 4,50,000 audience belonging to income group having more than 15,000 monthly income and it reaches to 50,000 belonging to 15,000 less than below 15,000 income group. So I'll write down the income groups here that is my target reach or audience. In case of audience, one is more than rupees 15,000 income, one is less than rupees 15,000 income. So those who are having more than 15,000 income, their reach here is 4,50,000 and here it will be 50,000. So total will be 5 lakhs. In case of radio, it is 20 and 80,000 that comes to 1 lakh and we need to maximize this audience or the total people or the reach. So first we we'll make the assumption that we are placing X1 and X2 advertisements on TV and radio. Let's first write the assumptions on the next page. Let number of advertisements on TV be X1 and radio be X2. So my first thing will be objective function 
my objective function will be to maximize the audience so maximize z equals to my audience here for tv is 5 lakhs for one advertisement multiply by number of advertisement x1 and in case of radio it is 1 lakh into x2 so 5 lakh x1 plus 1 lakh x2 will be my objective function 5 lakh x1 plus 1 lakh x2 subject to what are my constraints now my first and foremost two constraints that we are just specified in the question is that there must be minimum three advertisements on tv and maximum five on the radio so x1 should be more than or equal to three and x2 should be less than or equal to five and then we have a budget constraint or the cost constraint that my cost will be 50,000 into x1 plus 20,000 into x2. 50,000 into x1 plus 20,000 into x2 less than or equal to my total budget is 2 lakhs. And then I will note down the non negativity constraints which are x1 more than equals to 0 and x2 more than equals to 0. So again this was a problem based on media very important from exam point of view media based problems. Thanks, thanks for watching this video. Do subscribe to our channel eCleda.